we need to write the digit in each place value. So remember, we count place values from the right. So first we have our ones, then our tens, hundreds, and thousands digits. At least that's for whole numbers. With decimals, we need to remember to count place values from the decimal point. But for whole numbers, we can count from the end. So remember, ones, tens, hundreds, thousands. So first, we have the number 4,593. So the thousands digit is a four. Remember, if we have a four digit number, the thousands digit will be the first digit. Then we have our hundreds digit, so that's a five. Our tens digit is a nine, and our ones digit is a three. Now we have 4,809. The hundreds digit is the third digit from the right, so that's an eight. The ones digit is on the end, so that's nine. The thousands is a four, and the tens is a zero. Finally, we have 3,190. So the ones digit is a zero, the hundreds digit is one, the tens digit is nine, and the thousands digit is a three. Now what we can do is use place value counters to represent numbers. So for 4,593, we can have 4,000 counters, 500 counters, 9 10 counters, and 3 1 counters. For 4,809, that's 4,000s, 800s, no 10s, and 9 1s. And for 3,190, that's 3,100, 9 10s, and no 1s. 